Hey, what's going on guys? And today I wanted to do a video review and take a quick look at the Umi Acoustics. These are basically sound absorbing panels with MDF slats. So in this video, I'm just gonna kind of walk you through um, the product um, you know, introduction here, the installation, show you some of the components that came with, and then we'll take a closer look at these panels. So um, in terms of the panel itself, these are extremely large. Um, I believe they measure a little above, right around seven feet or so. Um, you can see I just laid this down here in one of my gym mat floors just to kind of give you an example, but it's quite large. Um, it has a really nice uh, kind of slat effect to it. So you basically have these pieces just going all along it and then the actual soundboard is here on the back. I'm gonna move the instructions over just so you can see how thick this is. If I lift this up with one hand, you can see it's probably about um, half inch thick and the whole backside is basically the um, actual acoustic panel. You can see it's basically just got uh, grommets here to attach the actual um, slats that just kind of go through it. Um, overall, you can see in the picture diagram, they give an example where all these are attached to one another. You do have a little bit extra length on the left hand side of this, whereas you can see on the right side, it's just kind of a groove. So that way, if you attach uh, multiples of these together, you could kind of use this to piece them together almost like a puzzle. And you can see in many of the examples, they just kind of show this up like behind a bed or um, using it as almost like an accent wall, but it's also gonna provide some additional sound um, insulating capabilities. My thinking with this is we're gonna be installing a brand new TV in a finished basement and I'm actually gonna make it an aesthetic look behind the TV and behind the speakers. So that way any sound that's being produced from the speakers is basically all gonna move forward and project into the room a little bit better while also providing a really nice aesthetic effect behind the TV. So to kind of give an example of that, let's say I had a corner wall like this I'd probably do like two of the slats going up and then another two on the other side and I'll have the TV actually mounted right in the corner. So it's actually gonna look pretty slick. Um, in terms of insulation, it basically just says it's a wood slat acoustic panel. It is um, kind of composited sound absorption structure as the sound waves travel to its surface. Some of them are reflected in all directions by the wood slats on the surface while others are absorbed directly by the polyester felt on the back of the product. Therefore, this is a product that combines the dual functions of diffusion and sound absorption. So again, pretty cool. Um, if you go on the back, they do give you kind of installation instructions. First, it says you get the tools ready, pencil, scale, screw, screwdriver, saw, or blade. You choose the method of installation. So you have two options. One, you can either lock the wood keel to the wall and lock the panel to the wood keels. Um, they say they recommend this to achieve the best sound absorption and diffusion effect or you can glue the panels directly to the wall using construction glue or grab adhesive and then secure the panel with the screws. It says they recommend using at least nine screws per panel. And they include a bag of these small um, black screws which are more than, more than enough if you're just going right through the panel itself. So overall, fairly straightforward. Um, they do come in, pack, they come in packs of two. Um, I actually got four of them total, so two packs. Um, you can see the rest of the, the ones I have here. These ones I haven't opened yet, but they do come very well packaged as well. So um, more or less, uh, you basically just take all this off and then you're ready to go and you've got everything you need. But I'd recommend just making sure you get enough um, depending on your project and what you're looking to do. Anyway, thanks for checking out my video review of these. Hopefully you found it helpful and I'll talk to you later. Um, I actually found a pr pretty good deal on it. I'll put a link to that in the comment below so you can check that out if you are interested in picking one up for yourself.